here with Kobe Abridi. Man, showtime tomorrow. How you feeling? I feel great, man. I just made ways with it on 125. First of all, I want to give a shout out to my Beijing people, my people in the Caribbean, people in the DMV. I want to give a shout out to Barry Hunter and Headbangers for making it happen. You know what I mean? And my friends and my family, my supporters, my coach, my team, everybody that made it happen. I want to thank everybody for um, supporting me. Man, it seems like you're making a, you're trying to make a real statement at 126. You know, you been, you started your career off fighting at 130, 135. You know, because you was having issues with guys trying to fight you. You know, mm -hmm. so you was taking it, and then you were winning. That's the thing. Yeah. You're still undefeated, man. Yeah. Um. Same thing. I feel good. I feel strong at 126. And March 24th, it's, I'm gonna show the world. I'm gonna show everybody who so the soldier is. And me and my coach, we've been grinding and we've been doing this. I'm a soldier. I'm ready to do this. What, what kind of different of Kobe Brady I'm going to see tomorrow that I haven't seen in the past? Man, we just, um, I want to give a shout out to my man, Carl. I shouldn't be playing Kobe. I don't know where he at. And, but, of course. Coach yep. But the, the only difference change we have, we just added a strength trainer and stuff. You know, keep me strong, keep me right. And, you know what I mean? I'm, I'm always in the gym. I'm staying in the gym. Like, we always grinding. And all I know is boxing. And that's what we've been doing. So now you get to uh, actually be, be participating on a t televised type card, you know, and also, you know, this is the moment you've been waiting for. Yeah, I've been for, for a very long time. I've been ready. You know, I fought, this is my third time fighting here at the gym. Mm -hmm. um, and this time is better than the last time. I'm going to take advantage of this. And when I get in the ring, March 24th, I'm going to show the world what I made of. And so, so these are the type of fights you're going to be looking for from here on out? Yes. Want to fight the best. Never want to fight the best. And this is your 13th fight coming 13th up? 13th fight. 13th fight coming up. And you know, you're in the mix with everybody. You know, you see young fighters with sometimes less than 13 fights on television already. Sometimes even fighting for titles. You know, so what kind of what kind of campaign are you going to make in that direction? Well, what we did is we kind of took the slow road. The mm -hmm. Slow road. Slow road, we wanted to go slow, work hard, and just keep building. And now we're to the point, whatever they throw at us, we take it. Because um, now it's title time. I mean, I said it from day one. Before he had 20 fights, we're going to fight for a title. We're 13 now, so now it's coming in full circle. By the time we get 15 fights, we might be going for a title. Looking at the U.S., one of the you know, titles out there. It's going for it. Yeah, and how long do you think that's going to be for you guys? Right now, this year. I would say definitely early next year. Okay. Later this year, early, definitely early next year. So you guys going to have a strong... This push strong, this year, right? This is the first first fight of the year, mm -hmm. and this is what we're doing at MGM. You know, I want to show the Beijing crowd, the American crowd, all his fans, how hard the soldiers been training, um, and what he's made of. You know, um, shout out again to Rihanna. We got a couple fingers to the ring, but we got to send the shout out. But on top of that, I mean, you know, we treat everybody, man. I mean, Kobe Soldier's been in the ring with who? Uh, I've been, I was in camp with Rashid Moore. Yeah. Uh, I've been, I've been, I've been sparring with uh, Sean Porter for a couple of rounds. So I, know, I know they, they know where I'm at. So I know where I, where I am at as a fighter. So I'm ready to you know, take the higher fights. And that's what we've been doing. There you have it, Kobe Abridi. Tomorrow on uh, FS1, Sunday at MGM. Appreciate it.